Car audio terminology can be pretty confusing. Here are just some of the basics. Amplifier. Increases an audio signal so it can be heard through a speaker or other audio device. Capacitor. A store of electricity and instant power for your amp. If your amp suddenly draws more power than it's available, the capacitor will make up the difference to avoid any interruption. Crossover. Sends audio frequencies to the right speakers. A crossover will direct highs to your tweeters, mids to your woofers, and low bass to your subwoofers. DIN and double DIN. A height and width standard for car head units. Created by German standards, the acronym stands for Deutsches Institut für Normung. A single DIN head unit measures 2 inches by 7 inches. A double DIN head unit measures 4 inches by 7 inches. Equalizer. Fine tunes your sound with more precision and control than standard bass and treble controls. Frequency response. The range of tones and frequencies a component can reproduce. Gain. Measured in decibels, gain is a term for the amount of amplification applied to a signal that increases its strength. Hertz. Sound frequency is measured in hertz, ranging between 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. High pass filter, low pass. A high pass filter is a filter, sometimes called a low cut, that reduces low frequencies below a certain cutoff frequency and allows frequencies above it to pass. A low pass filter attenuates, or filters out, the high end signals while allowing the low end to pass through. IPX rating. IP stands for ingress protection, where the letters and numbers in the designation indicate resistance to dust, particles, and liquid. For example, IPX4 is protection from splashing water from any direction. IPX8 protects when immersed in water over 3 feet. Ohm. In the most literal definition, ohms is the term used to represent impedance of a speaker. Speaker impedance is the amount of load that a speaker places on an amplifier. Peak power. The highest level of power a speaker can handle, or that an amplifier can output. Running your system too long at or near peak wattage ratings can result in distorted, crackly sound and component damage. RMS RMS refers to how much continuous power a speaker can handle, or how much continuous power an amplifier can output. RMS values are a truer measure of watts than peak power ratings. Sensitivity rating the loudness of a speaker when only one watt of power is sent to it as measured from exactly one meter away using a special measurement microphone. The higher the sensitivity, the louder it will play. A speaker with a sensitivity rating of 90 decibels will be louder than a speaker with a rating of 87 decibels at the same distance. It may not seem like much, but that three decibel difference is effectively the same as doubling the power of the amplifier. Subwoofer. A subwoofer is actually a speaker used to reproduce the very low frequencies. These frequencies may vary from 20 Hz to 200 Hz in particular. Tweeter. A speaker targeted to handle the upper high range of audio frequencies. Watt. The power output of an amplifier is measured in watts. It's a measure of the amount of energy it creates. With speakers, watts refers to the amount of power a speaker can handle. I'm Colin from Boss Basics. We'll see you soon.